What's up, Learn How Nation? In this video, I'm going to show you how to use Shopify, a beginner's guide to e-commerce. I'm Andy and you're watching Learn How. We create video lessons and tutorials to help people learn how to use technology to improve their lifestyle. So if you like what you see in this video, please consider subscribing. If you haven't seen some of our other Shopify videos, I would highly recommend checking those out to help you guys understand a little bit better about selling products on Shopify. So you can find those links in the description as well. All right, guys, if you're new to Shopify, I've got a link below this video that'll get you a free 14 day trial, no credit card required. So you guys can check out Shopify and learn about it to see if it's something that you really want to do as far as a place to sell your products online, whether that's drop shipping or selling your own products. We're gonna talk all about drop shipping, all about selling products online some strategies as well as step-by-step -step tutorials to show you how to make a very professional quality website and you don't need to be a programmer you don't need any any type of programming skills it's very simple to lay out and I'll show you how on this channel but like I said in this video guys I'm gonna show you how to get set up on Shopify how to use Shopify so let's jump right onto Shopify's website and get started. So right here, guys, after you click the link in the video, it's gonna take you right to this web page. And you can see right here, you can get started with Shopify for free for 14 days with no credit card. So I'm just gonna click get started. And then I'm gonna enter in a email address to use. I'm going to use this email. I'm gonna create a password. I'm gonna call it computer chaos. All right, guys. Now it's getting me set up with my Shopify store. So we're gonna, gonna go through this step-by-step -step process. Tell us a little bit about yourself. Are you already selling? Uh, I'm not selling products just yet. Do you have something to sell? Hmm, no, I'm just playing around with Shopify. What is your current revenue? revenue? Zero, I'm just getting started. And am I setting it up for a client? No, I am not. Okay. So now I'm just gonna put in a bunch of my personal info to get to the next screen. We'll skip this part. All right, guys, right here now, we're right into the Shopify dashboard. One of the first things you're gonna see at the top is to select a plan. You can get your Shopify store set up without selecting a plan, but you can't actually start selling your product until you select a plan. So you can spend these 14 days creating your store, adding products, uh, getting it set up, and then once you're ready to start selling, you're gonna wanna choose a plan. I'm gonna do another video to kind of talk about the different Shopify plans, but for most of you guys, that $29 a month basic Shopify plan is going to be perfect. It's the plan that I used for the fishermansfactory.com where I sell fishing lures on my Shopify store. And it's it's a great plan that works just fine for the solopreneur or any of you if you're just like a stay at home trying to make a side income selling products online. But you don't need to do that right now. So let's go back to the home page and let's kind of browse around and see what we have on this home page. Okay, so you're gonna see right here, there's some gonna be some first steps, guys. You're gonna wanna add a product, you're gonna wanna customize your theme, and you're gonna wanna add your own domain. I strongly encourage, once you get started, once you pick a plan, to add your own domain name. And the nice thing about Shopify, guys, is you can create your own domain, or I should say, buy your own domain name right here within Shopify. For those of you that have ever created a website with like WordPress or Bluehost, and you bought a domain name on GoDaddy, it can be a little bit tricky to connect your domain name to your website. It takes a little bit of tech savvy to figure that out. But within Shopify, it's as easy as clicking buy a domain, searching for a domain name that you want. Uh, so for my store, I guess it would be computerchaos.com. Boom, it's available, $14 a year. Oh, just kidding, they faked me out, unavailable. But here's some other uh, ideas and I can I can mess around with that as, as I want to. Another smart idea, guys, uh, for those of you that are just getting started with Shopify, is before you choose a, st a Shopify store name, go on GoDaddy, go on Google Domains, and search for domains that are available. So you don't necessarily have to buy your domain over there on GoDaddy, but let's say, let's go to GoDaddy and look for uh, names that are related to computers. So like computerchaos.com was already taken. Uh, so I don't want to use that. But let's say like computer crazies is available. 
So then I know, okay, that's available. I don't need to buy it on GoDaddy. On GoDaddy. I'm going to run over to Shopify, set up my store like I just showed you, name my store Computer Crazies. And then when I come here to, to buy my domain name, I can type in buy Computer Crazies because I know it's available and then buy it right through Shopify. It's, it's a lot easier if you buy your domain right there through Shopify. And it doesn't cost you any extra. It's about the same price that you'd pay on Google Domains or GoDaddy. So in my opinion, it's worth it. The first thing though I would recommend guys once you're getting started with your Shopify store is to customize your theme. So I'm gonna click right here, right in the middle of the screen, customize theme. And I'm going to click customize. And this is the home page of your Shopify store. You're gonna wanna add a bunch of stuff here. But something that you're really going to want to do, guys, maybe before you get started with this, is think about what theme you want to use. Let's go back really quickly to that main home screen and look at the different themes. Back here in the themes, you'll see over on the left under online store, you can click themes. If I scroll down, I can explore free themes. So here's a bunch of different themes of stores that I can use. So hmm, let's think here for like a computer type of uh website selling computer products this one might be a good fit oh this is my current theme so right here you can see right at the top it's live so that's the current theme i'm working with but if i wanted to switch to a different theme i could click on it and then click adventure but actually i do like that theme right here you can see it says live i do like that theme so maybe that's the theme that i'm going to roll with so then i'll go back up here to customize and i can start customizing my uh, home page essentially so Right here in the header, you can add an image. This would be like up here in the top left. Uh, let me explore some free images and see what we got available. Let's see if there's computer. Oh, okay, so we got a few computer stuff. Let's try that one. So look, that creates a, uh, a header logo up in the top left of my homepage. And if I want, I can you know do a little announcement bar and say something like, uh, 50% off all shipping. And let's see, uh, we'll just leave it good like that for now. So I'll click save. And the nice thing here guys on the left, when you click on stuff, it scrolls down to what you're doing. So you kind of have an idea of what you're editing. So this top image would be this main home image. Um, let's see, maybe I'll go back to computer really quickly and see if there's a good image that I like for this part. This image is pretty cool sweet okay so then you can see right here i can change the 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 heading so i could say um shop computer accessories and then there's this like paragraph text i can use a uh, great collection of cords chargers cases to choose from not saying you want to say this guys but we're just i'm just showing you how you can edit this boom save back then i can go to the featured collection i can change all this kind of stuff but as far as the featured collection goes guys you can mess with that after we add products and that's going to be in an upcoming video where i show you guys how to customize all that but as far as the home screen goes for customization this is where you'd probably want to customize your header so you can see here the header image maybe doesn't look that great uh, i would recommend maybe creating a logo if you see on my website, learnhowgroup.com, I've got a logo as my header at the top of the website. And that's what I'd recommend doing. So you can do text and an image to create a little website logo. Looks very professional. Uh, so that's something that I'd recommend. So anyways, I'll just remove that for now because it doesn't really flow that well. Uh, but yeah, so like I said, you're gonna to wanna to customize your theme homepage from right here. And you can customize, you can add sections, you can add a slideshow. So down here at the bottom, I can tell a story. Uh, so if I wanna add an image slide to here, once again, I can just, I can use free images, which is really nice, guys. You don't have to pay uh, for stock images, but I can add some images here. Uh, so there's a slide. I can change the text right here. Um, you can see that it's a little fuzzy because it's kind of zoomed in. It's kind of a blurry photo as it is. So maybe that's not the, the image I want to use. But for an example, you can say uh, family, own business, whatever. And then the other thing too, you can add a link. So I could link this slide to like a blog post or something. 
So if someone wanted to learn more about, you know, our business or, or, uh, what, what our about story, uh, the slideshow is a nice place to do that. This is a, a really easy section to use guys, and you can play around with it, play around with the different sections, remove sections, drag them around and order them how you want. You can change the theme settings. So you can change like the, the, the main colors, the main fonts, uh, that this, that the theme uses. But you can see guys right there in like literally a couple minutes, we already got a pretty legit looking uh, homepage for our computer website or our computer store. So it's really, Shopify guys, is really easy to use. Uh, it's really easy to set up and you can get a really professional looking website to sell your products very quickly. Once you're finished guys customizing your, your theme, just click save and we're gonna go back to the home screen our home dashboard and I can click this little eyeball icon over here next to online store to view my my store as like a preview to kind of see what it looks like. Uh, so yeah, there you have it. That's our computer chaos store as of right now with um, with what we have. As you add products, we can fill out this collection section, which will be in another video. Like I said, uh, we'll also work on, you know, customizing the menus and making product pages look professional so that when people come to your website, they'll feel very comfortable buying from you. That's the basic overview, guys, of getting your Shopify store up and running uh, to start designing it. Like I said, adding products is a whole new ball game, so we'll get into that. And if you're gonna be doing a drop shipping store, I'll show you how to connect to AliExpress and to other platforms to automatically add in products for you. It's very nice. Um, so we'll do a bunch of tutorial videos on that. But for any type of store, drop shipping or selling your own products, this is how you get up. This is how you get set up, guys. And like I said, super easy, no credit card needed. You can play around with it, design a store for 14 days and not have to worry about getting charged. And then once you're ready to start selling your product, just choose a plan and you're on your way to making money. If you like this video, guys, hit that thumbs up button. Leave me a comment with your questions that you might have. Like I said, there's a link right below this video for you to get the free 14 day Shopify trial. Just click it. It'll take you right to the store. Um, and I, I, I'll, I'd love to answer any questions that you have about Shopify, about making money online, about selling products online. But like I said, we're going to be talking all about it on the YouTube channel and make sure you guys check out our Facebook group, learn how group, dash online business on Facebook because we're going to be sharing our videos in there. We're also going to be sharing some live content and some questions and things and discussions in there. It's a lot easier place to discuss than necessarily on YouTube. So go and request to join that group. All right, guys, check out some other videos here we've got on our channel. Make sure you subscribe and we'll see you in the next video.